I'm going to talk about how the seasons change on the planet Earth. Right now, the sun is facing the n northern hemisphere on the planet Earth. So it is summer there, and the sun is not facing the southern hemisphere. So that's why it is winter in the southern hemisphere. Three months later, a season changes, so then the equator is facing the sun. So that means there is the same amount of heat on both sides, and from summer and winter, one season changed. So, on the northern part, on the northern part, it is fall, and the southern part, it's spring. Three months later, another season changes. So then, the northern, the northern part is not facing the sun; it's facing away from the sun, and the southern part. In the southern part is facing the sun. So that's why it is summer on the southern part and winter on the northern part. Three months later, the equator is facing the sun. So there's both, so there's the same amount of heat on both sides. And spring, and the season changes, so then spring comes for the northern, from the northern part and Fall comes for the southern for the southern part, and three months later, it's been a whole time the Earth has gone around the sun, one whole year, 365 days, and now the northern hemisphere is facing the sun, and the sou southern hemisphere is away facing is away from the sun. So that's why it is summer on the northern and the northern hemisphere, and winter on the su southern hemisphere. The reason this happens is because Earth rotates around the sun and Earth is 23 degrees tilted on its axis. And the planet Uranus is 90 degrees tilted on its axis. That's why Uranus goes like this around the sun. Jupiter, Jupiter is two degrees tilted on its axis. That means, just like Mercury, it does not have that many seasons going. That's why Jupiter is two degrees. 